Welcome to True Projects. In this video, we are going to explain about encrypted network traffic classification using deep and parallel network in network models. Introduction The task of classifying network traffic which entails identifying various traffic or application categories by inspecting data packets is covered in the project. The project draws attention to the shortcomings of current methodologies for classifying encrypted traffic such as payload based and port based approaches. The project suggests using machine learning techniques in particular deep learning models for the classification of encrypted traffic. For identifying encrypted network traffic the project offers a neural network model with deep and parallel network in network NIN architecture. The suggested method maps fixed length packet vectors to application or traffic labels using deep NIN models with several MLP convolutional layers. The project's findings show that the, that compared to standard CNN the suggested NIN and models can achieve a superior balance between classification accuracy and model complexity objective the project's objective is to suggest a neural network model for categorizing encrypted network traffic that has deep and parallel nin architecture the suggested method maps fixed length packet vectors to application or traffic labels using deep nin models with several mlp convolutional layers in addition the project introduces a parallel decision technique that involves creating two sub networks to process packet header and packet body separately in light of the possibility that they may contain various classification related hints in comparison to typical cnn convolutional neural network the initiative seeks to strike a better balance between classification accuracy and model complexity requirements the requirements of the project are hardware requirements and software requirements in hardware requirements we have operating system windows only processor i5 and above ram 4 gb and above hard disk 20 gb and above software requirements in software requirements we have python ideally with 3.7 version methodology to implement the, this project we have designed the following modules the first module is upload iscx vpn non vpn dataset in this module the iscx vpn non vpn dataset is collected and uploaded this dataset likely contains network traffic data captured under under various conditions including encrypted virtual private network vpn and non vpn scenarios this dataset forms the foundation for training and evaluating the classification model second module is data pre processing before the data can be fed into the classification models it need to be pre processed this involves tasks like data cleaning feature extraction and normalization for encrypted traffic this might include decryption to a certain extent to extract relevant features for classification third module is run standard cnn algorithm a convolutional neural network cnn model is utilized to classify network traffic into different categories such as vpn and non vpn cnn convolutional neural network are particularly effective for task involving spatial data like images or in this case network traffic packets the standard cnn convolutional neural network algorithm is trained on the pre processed data set to learn patterns that differentiate between different types of encrypted network traffic fourth module is run deep parallel nin algorithm the deep parallel network in network nin algorithm is another neural network model employed for classification nin is known for its ability to capture intricate relationships with within data through its unique network in network architecture by running the deep parallel nin algorithm the project aims to improve classification accuracy and robustness compared to traditional methods fifth module is comparison graph after training and testing both the standard cnn and the deep parallel nin models a comparison graph is generated this graph likely displays metrics such as accuracy precision recall and f1 score for both models This visual representation allows for a clear understanding of how well each model performs in classifying encrypted network traffic. Sixth module is traffic classification using encrypted test data. In this module the trained models are employed to classify new and previously unseen encrypted network traffic. This simulates real world scenarios where the models are put to use for actual traffic classification, helping network administrators identify VPN and non-VPN traffic instances. Execution for the execution of the project we need to open the code folder. 
this is the code folder this is the data set folder we have used iscx data to implement this project importing this data set contains the information of flow id distance ip distance port protocol timestamp flow duration total forward packet total backward packet total length etc this is the model folder this folder contains .h files which contains algorithm information these .h files can be loaded into the project code during runtime to utilize the train models this is the main code file this is run.batch file instead of executing a project in the command line interface we have created windows batch file to execute the project double click on run.batch file a graphical user interface will pop up this is the graphical user interface which we have created using tkintel library in python using this gui we will interact with the project click on upload iscx vpn non vpn data set select iscx data open so here in above screen data set loaded and we can see data set contains both numeric and non numeric data with symbols has encrypted data but deep learning algorithm only accept numeric data so we need to convert above data into numeric format by applying label encoding class and this is the graph network category graph in above graph x axis represents different traffic types exist in data set and y axis represents count now close the graph and click on data pre processing to process data in above screen entire data set is converted to numeric format and then in the last lines we can see the total records exist in data set and we can see train and test split date details now click on run standard cnn algorithm to train existing cnn so here we can see that we got the accuracy precision recall f score of the standard cnn algorithm and this is the confusion matrix existing standard cnn confusion matrix x axis represents predicted labels and y axis represents true labels and all blue boxes contains incorrect prediction count which are few and all different color boxes contain correct prediction count now close the graph and click on run the parallel nin algorithm to train proposed algorithm so here we can see we got the accuracy precision recall f score of the proposed parallel deep nin algorithm and this is the confusion matrix so here x axis represents the predicted class and y axis represents the true labels and all blue boxes contain incorrect prediction count which are few and all different color boxes contain correct prediction count now close the graph click on comparison graph so this is the comparison graph x axis represents the different algorithms and y axis represents the performance metric value so here we can see that each algorithm is having a different metric and each metric is represented with a different color so we can see that blue color represents accuracy orange color represents f score green color represents precision red color represents recall and from this graph we can say that nin algorithm performs well now close the graph and click on traffic classification using encrypted test data select test data and open so here we can see that this is the traffic test data and this test data is classified as audio streaming and just like this we can predict all the test data into so this is predicted as video streaming 
and if we scroll below we can see that this test data is classified as email and this test data is classified as email so in this way we can predict the traffic classification now close the gui and the final conclusion of the project is according to the project's finding deep and parallel network in network nin models performed better than traditional cnn when used to classify encrypted network data the accuracy of employing a single nin model for traffic classification was further enhanced by the simultaneous decision method of establishing two sub networks for processing packet header and packet body separately According to the initiative future research should concentrate on improving the performance of encrypted traffic classification using only application layer data in general the suggested nin model offers a potential method for categorizing encrypted communication with a better balance between classification accuracy and model complexity thank you for watching video for more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in For updates on latest project videos, please visit True Projects YouTube channel and subscribe.